You ready to fight? Ready. All right, so this highly anticipated stand-up only event is now underway. Friendly reminder on the rules and hopefully you play by them. No grappling of any type. So if you like striking, this is the event for you. Also, fighters cannot do follow-up strikes on the floor. This is a stand-up only event. Let's see how it plays out. Just missed with the leg kick. Snapped off the jab nicely there. It's a beautiful fast foot jab with beating. Nice display of technique by him there on the sidekick. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Very good. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, tie, grab, or wrestle. He's, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. Huh. Oh, with authority, the body. of your seat action as expected thus far. Oh, man, John, they're trading early. All right, so an opportunity goes by the boards. He had him stunned, nearly finished, and now his opponent has recovered. And this is why you pay to be in the building. Back and forth we go. Throws a big right hand, but doesn't find it's home. There's that body shot. Aspinall's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Under two minutes to go. Body shot there. Nice body kick there. Throwing that low kick. Right hook coming, it's blocked. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. In a big moment in this fight. All right, so the big storyline in this one, his offensive prowess, particularly when it comes to landing those hooks. And I know you'd like to play Tony Romo. You think he goes back to it here? Well, I am almost certain that he's gonna go back to that specific punch because it's landed every time he's thrown it. And as the fight has gone on, it is landing with more force and his opponent is starting to wear down. So I will not be surprised if we see another one that ends the fight. Oh, man, he's hurt. Oh, big knee to the body. How'd he get that one home? Now standing round and another five minutes coming up. All right, so that's the end of the round. Pretty significant damage done in that round. Cut on the cheek, sustained there from that strike. Now the cut man's got to get in there and close that thing up. Better to be below the eye than above it, sure. But nonetheless... You ready to fight? Ready. Here we are, early round two. All right, so after one of the more entertaining rounds in recent UFC history... He's rocked. That was a beautiful hook. It landed perfectly, and it hurt his opponent very bad. Right hook to the head blocked. Watch for him to set up that hook again now. Nice spinning yeah. attack to the body lands for him. Straight right hand, no good. Targeting that swelling. Why would you not, right? You doled out all this damage. Might as go, might as well go right back to it. Well, especially if your opponent is not gonna move his head. He's still trying to go out on his shield. He's he's so stubborn in trying to prove that he's tough. It's really costing him right now. Well, he continues to do a nice job here defensively, protecting his head, raising the guard, and really frustrating the offensive fighter a little bit. Lesson one in boxing class, hands up, chin down. Wow, it looks as though that strike maybe opened up a cut around the eye. Massive, massive hook lands, and his opponent seems to be on his way out of the fight. 
separate from the clinch now. Oh, great block there. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Just missed on that. MMA is a constant exercise in risk mitigation, right? But it would seem to me that if he really goes for it offensively, he get him Well, he's got him hurt. He's got him hurt. He's got him hurt multiple times in one round. It looks like this fight should be over by now, but his opponent's still standing, and I think that speaks to the durability of the guy standing in front of him. Overeem's doing a nice job there. You saw him raise the guard to block that offering from the opponent. Don't want to sustain any more damage on that cut that has already been opened up. Take your time, relax, breathe. Man, has he landed a high volume of strikes. Oh, 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 I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. The official decision is in. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean is going to stop to this contest at four minutes, 30 seconds of round number two. We're playing the winner by knockout and new undisputed USC heavyweight champion.